Hello guys, today I am going to give you some tricks or you can say mnemonics regarding our crab cycle. Let us see. This is crab cycle which is also called TCA cycle. Now, uh, firstly we will look that uh, the introduction of crab cycle and what is the content in it. Firstly, we know that uh, our uh, glycolysis from glycolysis we, we can get pyruvic acid and this pyruvic acid further converted into acetyl coenzyme A and this acetyl coenzyme A goes to the cyclic process which is called Krebs cycle and this Krebs cycle acetyl coenzyme A is condensed or mixed with oxaloacetic acid and this oxaloacetic acid and crab cycle mix and combine to form citrate and after that this citrate is converted into isocitrate and this isocitrate is further converted into oxaloxacinic acid and this oxaloxacinic acid is further converted into keto alpha ketoglutarate and this alpha ketoglutarate is converted into succinyl coenzyme A and this succinyl coenzyme A is converted into succinic acid and this succinic acid is further converted into malic acid and this malic acid is converted into finally again we can get this oxaloacetic acid now these are these are the steps so uh, these are the steps we cannot um, uh, forget all these steps so that I, can, I have made a, a simple tricks or mnemonics you can say to remember all these steps which is 8 steps so let us look here I made the, a mnemonics like she is okay she smiles in a fresh manner of course again look she is okay she you can write C. She is okay. C smiles in fresh manner, of course. Like C means citrate, is isocitrate, O means oxalosaxonic acid, K means alpha ketoglutarate, and C means succinyl coenzyme, smiles means succinate, and fresh means fumarate, and manner means mallet and of course means oxaloacetic acid so here are our mnemonics to remember this crab cycle in a very simple manner or a uh, mnemonic mnemonic way so again uh, this these are the crab cycle and outcomes are here and a 3 na dh na dh2 plus 2 ca2 is evolved so these are the out in outcome and one phosph uh, substrate level phosphorylate, uh, phosphorylation is also takes place uh, which finally give us GTP from GDP and this GTP and G, uh, GTP that we gain again converted into ATP so this is called substrate level phosphorylation which is takes place in this uh, uh, succinyl coenzyme to the succinic acid so thank you